Yeah, well, medical cannabis uh, needs to be differentiated from cannabis generally for recreational use. It's the same plant, uh, which has been used for thousands of years for recreational, spiritual and, and medical use. In fact, cannabis was the first medicine ever described and written down by man about 5,000 years ago. The negative connotation from cannabis is really this hangover from, I think, the really racist and unscientific campaign that was started in the US against cannabis. It started in the 1920s. It really persisted through the prohibition of, on drugs era. This is part of it. Even today in the UK, we have, um, you know, a political system that's very, you know, they, everyone wants to be hard on drugs. Cannabis was made legal in the UK if prescribed by a specialist doctor in 2018. Ironically, uh, the catalyst for this was actually parents of children who were suffering from severe epilepsy campaigning for better access. And unfortunately, nearly five years on from this being made available for adults, children are still finding it exceptionally hard to obtain these life-improving medicines. So my son Alfie has a condition called PCDH19. He was diagnosed with that at age five. It's usually a, con a condition that affects girls only, so it's a genetic condition. When I took to Google and cannabis just kept coming up and I just immersed myself in learning, I found that cannabis worked on the endocannabinoid system. I learned from videos I watched on YouTube. Up until that point, I viewed cannabis as a recreational drug and that's all I thought it was. And then I realized it was a medicine and that's why we then decided to, to go to Holland and use cannabis as medicine with Alfie legally. So we have a system inside of our brains and our bodies, which is an overall kind of balancing system or what we call homeostasis system. And it's called the endocannabinoid system. And the reason why cannabinoids work so well in the brain and the body for so many kind of diverse symptoms is because the system is involved in so many diverse activities, ranging from immune regulation, to sleep-wake cycle regulation, mood regulation, response to stress and trauma, um, neuroinflammation and inflammation in different, different organ systems. Uh, the Arc Review Group uh, issues a report uh, every year on the international cannabis market. And uh, we know that in, in the United States, uh, cannabis, illegal cannabis, is the fastest growing industry in the entire country.